Pacers will assemble. Let's meet the field for our fifth qualifier, number one, Full View. This is a Some Beach Somewhere Colt owned by Millar Farms, trained by Eric Adams. The driver is Randy Waples. Number one, Full View was a $215,000 yearling purchase at Harrisburg. Number two, Pharaoh's Reign, War We Needy Colt, owned by Carl Jameson and Bill Jones, trained by Jameson. Jody Jameson does the driving, a $10,000 Lexington buy. Number three, Better Focus, Better's Delight Colt, owned by Westwind Stable, Brad Grant, McKinley and Fielding, and Teresa Davidson, trained by Casey Coleman, Bob McClure Drives, Better Focus, a $40,000 Lexington Selected Yearling Sale Purchase. Four, Rockin' the Aces, this is a Rock and Roll Heaven Colt, owned by Robert Barry, trained by Carmen Osiello, Jonathan Drury's in the Sulky, a $60,000 Harrisburg Purchase. Five, Irish Prince, Royal Majesty Colt, Owned by Brad Gray, trained by Corey Giles. Trevor Henry does the driving this morning, an $18,000 London buy. And number six, Groovy Joe, a roll with Joe Colt, owned by Windback Farms, trained by Blake McIntosh. James McDonald's in the Sulky, a $17,000 Goshen yearling sale purchase. Field of six for qualifier number five. Starting gate reaches the top of the stretch. A half dozen two-year-old pacing colts are lined up. They're picking up speed, and here they come. And they're off and pacing. Pretty even beginning here. We'll give the first call to Groovy Joe on the outside. Groovy Joe will push ahead as Better Focus is out of their well. There's Rockin' the Aces in third at the inside, Pharaoh's Reign. Outside of that one is Irish Prince, and last is Full View. Into the first turn they go, and up top it is Groovy Joe. So Groovy Joe started on the far outside, gets up to the top, avoids the shadows heading to the opening quarter, leading by a length and a half. Racing in second, that is better focus. The opening quarter was 32 and 3. Moving into the back stretch with the wind pushing them now, Groovy Joe by a length and a half. Better focus in second, followed by Rockin' the Aces in third third. Pacing in fourth is Pharaoh's Reign, followed fifth by Irish Prince, and then a gap of two to the trailer, full view, as they go by three-eighths. So the field of six. A pretty tight pack here as they head up the backside, following Groovy Joe, second qualifier for this son of Roll with Joe. Racing in second, it's the debuting Better Focus, the son of Better's Delight. Then in third, it's the Rock and Roll Heaven Colt rocking the Aces as the half is up in 103 and 4, 31 and 1 second quarter. We'll check in with Pharaoh's Reign, who is about five or six from the top, racing in fourth and is a son of War We Needy. Then in fifth, and getting steppy and going off stride went the Royal Majesty Colt Irish Prince. So gaining a spot is the son of some beach somewhere. Full view who is in fifth. Up top it's Groovy Joe with the lead. From fourth now Pharaoh's Reign is making a move. Up into third. Now up into second. It's a two and a half length advantage for the leader at three quarters in 133 flat. Turning for home. Groovy Joe with the lead. Pharaoh's Reign coming on the outside is now moved into second. Still two lengths away. Approaching the eighth pole. Groovy Joe the leader. Pharaoh's Reign. Better focus. And as they come into the final eighth of the mile, Groovy Joe is called upon trying to finish this one off. Here comes Rockin' the Aces on the outside. Rockin' the Aces into second, still three lengths away. And Groovy Joe, a good-looking performance here, will win. Rockin' the Aces was second. Better Focus was third. Pharaoh's Reign fourth. Full View fifth. Sixth will be Irish Prince, 201 and one